Jimmy Mook! Hello, and welcome to my first video on my channel that we're going to be doing a new series here where I am going to be opening up some cards. Um, so... I'm a bit of a collector, at least I used to be, and uh, I recently got back into the hobby, so um, I thought why not start sharing some of these uh, pack openings and some of these box openings that I'm doing um, on this new channel, so we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, we're going to start ourselves off here with uh, some 2022 Skybox Metal Universe uh, Champions. And we're also doing a 2023 draft, uh, uh, Panini Select Draft Picks. So um, both of these, we're doing blaster boxes of these. Now, I had already pre-recorded um, pack openings, or opening both of these blasters, and I did not like the way the video went. So um, lighting was terrible, camera angle was terrible, everything was terrible about it. So rather than subject you guys to it, I'm just going to go ahead and re-record. We already ripped everything. I'm just going to do like a quick recap of everything we pulled out of here. Um, so these Skybox uh, Metal Universe Champions, I like these. I, I, I opened some of these last year as well. Um, and it's like a mix. It's like a mix of everything. Just um, sports stars and um, even like some like obscure sports and stuff. You just get like a random mix. And sometimes you get even non-sports people in here. But... Um, this year's I, I did this is my first uh they actually know this is my second box that i opened of this stuff this year so far of the at least of the 2022 version but um there's the uh all the info there for you um th there's some good inserts and good parallels and stuff you can get in here um i mean obviously you're looking for numbered cards there's like the silver dot parallels which are big um, a lot of the more common stuff like metal shredders and fresh foundations so we got some of those but you're always looking for autos with this set um, from some big names from random sports and uh, uh, the big one is like the jambalaya cards which are like super rare I think they're like one in like 6400 or something like that so um, so that's gonna be a good one so let's go ahead and start with that one and uh, I'll show you guys let me let me show you what we got in that one this is some of the base stuff that I got so this is basically what the base cards look like um, for those that you view that haven't seen them again they're pretty cool I love the way these medals cards look I always love the NBA medals cards and even the NHL I never ripped any of the NHL medals but like these is, I just love the medals look it's, it's a really interesting looking card um, but yeah we got Italia Tongvaloa um, got a Armando Cruz um, there's a Griffey. I always love seeing a Griffey in these packs. Um, Danny Dandrade. But yeah, there's like there's a look at your Fresh Foundations cards. Um, it's Master Teague on the uh, Aqua Parallels. Um, yeah, we even got like a... I don't know if that's like a, some kind of martial arts or whatever. Judo or something like that. Um, got some soccer players. There's a great Sam Howell of the Skybox... Let me get so we can get that in the shot. But the Skybox Premium Metal. So it's, I think those are supposed to be kind of like a throwback to the old metals, the old Metal Universe stuff. I think actually these are like the Retro Metal or something like that. I can't remember what they're called offhand. But got a good John Dots in there. But a lot of this stuff is base stuff. You got some golfers, uh, race car. Well, I think that's a race car driver. Um, UFC guys. You know, more baseball, basketball. Um, another aqua there so the aqua parallels are pretty cool but they're only like one in four so they're pretty common um, more UFC but yeah so we've got we got some good stuff um, I know that one's not bad Brady house I don't know I don't know how he's doing I didn't really follow baseball that whole a whole lot but uh, Desmond Ritter but yeah there's good, some good stuff so there's your base stuff and then uh, Let's take a look at some of the ones, some of the better cards that I like. So um, these are the Skybox Premium. Sorry, the other ones I thought they were premium, but I think those are like the retro Skybox or whatever they're called. Um, it's kind of like a throwback, but these are the premium cards. So we got ourselves the card number one of the series, which is Michael Jordan. That's cool. That's always sleeve that one up because I always love getting a good Michael Jordan card. Uh, let's see. So there's our metal shredders. We've got some good metal shredders. Another Skybox Premium. So these are sticking together. Now these is one of our good inserts, which is a uh, this one's a Darius Garland Z Force uh, card, silver. Oops. Uh, let's take a look at that. So yeah, here's the back of it. But um, this card actually, and this one's sleeved. I'll probably have to actually probably should do a hard 
do a uh, top loader for this because I actually looked this card up um, before this and it pulls actually pulls a pretty penny so um, I mean not like any not making like anything to write home about but you know in a in a a non auto or non like rare card in this set this, this card pulls down like ten dollars on average which is crazy but uh, yeah the Z force is one of the better inserts to get but yeah, on this channel, we're going to do a lot of, uh, I love this, like I said, I love the skybox stuff, but we're going to do a lot of football, um, mostly football, because I love football, especially college stuff. Um, and then we got ourselves another Brady House and skybox premium. Uh, get these all stick together. Some fresh foundations, um, which is like kind of like a rookie card um, for this set. And then so the aqua is the parallel of those so those aren't too bad but there's a, there's some other parallels you can get to in the sky in the uh, like you can get a silver ref, uh, refractor in these there's some that one i really like that's a metal shredders bryce young so everybody knows bryce young is the uh is the uh number one pick so yeah that was a good card i was happy to get that one and then uh, our last one that i liked was uh, uh Dewey, dj uliago lele um fresh foundations of him now he's still in college um is that currently this is when this is a sh this is a shot from when he was at clemson but he's currently at oregon state as the starting quarterback so yeah that was a good uh that was a good pack now what i just re realized that i forgot is what i'm usually going to do in these videos is i'm I, you know i like to buy singles a lot so we're probably going to do some uh I'll do some sharing with some of my new pickups when I buy single cards here and there so uh, right now i don't really have anything to bring to the table but we're uh so this is this is the only thing I really have got right now of note that I've brought in recently. Um, this is the uh, an Isaiah Oliver um, elite uh, draft pick status um, auto, and that's a silver auto or whatever. So you can tell it's got the silver refractor kind of finish to it. Um, but um, that one I really wanted. Um, I don't believe. Yeah, I don't think this one's numbered. Or no, it is numbered. I'm sorry, it's right there. Twelve. This is a twelve of twenty-five. So. Um, see if you can get that but yeah um yeah i just i i um i'm a fan of us uh, of colorado university and i and as a disclaimer i've been a fan f pretty much since i was a kid because i grew up in denver so um yeah that's so i'm not on the i'm not on the whole sanders bad and wag deon sanders bad and wag, even though i do love deon sanders and i do love what the team's doing even though they've lost they've been kind of dropping off as the seasons wore on here but I still believe in them. Um, still my team. I'm still there through the rough years. Uh, I was there for all the garbage years. So it's nice to at least that they're kind of a recognized uh, school now again. It's, it's about time that they kind of got back in the, at least got some notoriety again. So I'm happy for them. But uh, yeah, I was happy to pick up that card. That's it's kind of like a, uh, for my personal collection, that's something that I, uh, that I uh, really, uh, um, kind of collect here and there as I, I uh, like to pick up those uh, Colorado buffs and love my buffs so um, one thing I did forget on that skybox metal these are two that I pulled from the last pack so those are pretty nice those are two fresh foundations we got Bryce Young again and we've got a CJ Stroud so those were those were some pretty good pickups that I liked from the last pack so let's move on to this box the uh, select draft picks 23 so here's uh let's see if we can speed it along a little faster here so we've got uh here's some of the ones i put i put erlacher on on top even though i'm not a chicago bears i am a fan of chicago teams except for football i don't uh, uh i just can't bring myself to cheer for the bears but um we got ourselves the brand erlacher um kind of a local hero um so even though I'm not really a Bears fan, it's cool to have that card, uh, even though it's not really a card of note. But but uh, yeah, that's a cool one to have. But you know, we got our Elaine Mining. It's a lot of the base stuff. So these are the base blue that I pulled from this bat blaster. Rob Gonkrowski, these are Joe Namus. Kenny Pickett, that one's not bad. Kenny Pickett on the second year. Uh, Christian Watson, second year. So there's some good stuff. A little Mike Allstott action, some Nick Chubb. Um, yeah, some T. Higgins, Danny and Tomlinson. Yeah, it's a lot of this base stuff. Is I mean, they're just they're kind of cool. I like their good looking cards and stuff. So, 
Um, but yeah, there's that. Alright, let's put those over there. So here's the stuff I sleeved that I really liked from this pack. So we got the Keely Ringo um, rookie card. Now, um, as, as a note for this channel, I will be keeping a lot of the San Francisco cards I get because I do, because I am a San Francisco 49ers fan. But I do um, also collect Philadelphia Eagles too, just for the wife, because uh, the wife is a huge Eagles fan. So. That's a good one to keep. Uh, we got our Jalen Hyatt rookie. That's another solid card. Kenny McIntosh over there from uh, the Seahawks. Uh, Devon uh, Achan, I think is now he's telling people to pronounce it. I can't remember, but he was looking pretty good there in Miami until he got hurt. Jalen Carter, another good Eagle rookie there to have. Will Levis, who just had a monster game um, about a week ago for Tennessee in his debut, four touchdowns. So I'm kind of happy to have that quarter quarter, although he did look kind of average in the game afterwards, or the next game, this last Thursday. So Josh Downs. Um, this one, I, I now I'm blanking on what this card is called. I looked it up and I figured out what this card was called, but it's uh, Jay Kaner, but it's got David Carr and features Derek Carr and David Carr on there. So we got the Carr brothers with Jay Kaner on there out of Fresno State. Pretty cool card. This one's a good one to have another rookie, Anthony Richardson. He's hot right now, even though he's injured and uh, I don't know. I don't really think it looked that good when he wasn't in when he wasn't playing. So a lot of a lot of big expectations for this guy, but I'm kind of. I'm a little skeptical on whether or not he can deliver, but his cards are hot right now, so it's good to have. Michael, we got so then we got the unstoppable uh, inserts. This is uh, this is the uh, Michael Mayer, and then we got a silver parallel that unstoppable and Bijan Robinson, which I'm really pumped to have that card. That's a nice card too. I like that. Looks good. And then uh, here's some of the some of the notable stuff. We got a Lawrence Taylor. This is a red. I believe this is a red laser. Um, parallel, yeah, these are those are pretty slick. Those are red laser, I like them. But I mean, in Lawrence Taylor, it's kind of weird. But got ourselves a red Xavier Xavier Hutchinson in the parallel as well, out of uh, Iowa State, there I believe Xavier Hutchinson's out of. But uh, yeah, and then and then there's the good one. This was the big. This was the hit, even though his card doesn't really pull anything. But it's a gold laser, and gold laser is what you're looking for in some of these blasters, at least for non autos and all that kind of stuff. That's a Marvin Mims, who I believe is a Bronco receiver, um, but that's on the gold laser. So that was a cool card to get. I like that one. So yeah, those were our big pickups. Um, the only other thing I got was I picked up some packs of uh, MVP hockey because I am going to feature some hockey on this too. Um, I was I used to be a monster hockey fan, but. I just kind of fell the last few years. Uh, um, like I said, Chicago sports other than football, so I'm a Hawks fan. So, but you know, the Hawks have been disappointing me the last few years, and not even not just on the ice, off the ice as well. So, I'm a little so-so on that organization. So I figured, why not uh, get back into some, maybe some hockey card collecting will start getting me to learn some of these young players' names. Um, but I mean, there's some guys I recognize, like Jeff Skinner and stuff, and. Yeah, Jonathan Marshall and, uh, you know, there's a few guys on say, of course, he's a legend, uh, or at least for me, he's a legend. I think he's a, he was a great player, Braden Shen, you know, Martin Nekos. Yeah, they, there's some good players in there, but it's, I don't know. I don't know if I'll pick up any more of these packs. I know the big packs are the, uh, um, are the Epic Deck Series 1 and Series 2, even though we're waiting for the Connor Bedard cards and they won't be out till Series 2. So look out for that. I'm probably going to be ripping a, uh, at least a blaster of that stuff when that finally comes out but um yeah um that's pretty much it um like i said look out for some uh, a lot of football stuff specifically a lot of college stuff we'll do some nfl um we're also going to mix in like i said some hockey maybe some basketball we are going to mix in once in a while i'm going to throw in some uh maybe some videos of some really like some non-sports stuff um um, I got a buddy Miles who has a channel uh, called Trading Cards to so check it out if you if you're into non-sports stuff. But uh, yeah, that's that that I love that kind of that weird uh, niche market of like non-sports stuff. Some of that really um, off the wall non-sports trading cards that they come up with, like movies and just random you know pop culture stuff. So look out for that. We'll probably be ripping some stuff of that too. So um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, that's that's pretty much it for me that was um uh, look out for the next video uh, we may maybe we'll do some hockey on the next video i got i got some hockey boxes coming in 
Um, I think I'm gonna get another blaster of some of some college stuff. Probably something different from this, but look out for that. We'll do some NFL. I don't know. The sky's the limit. I'm, I'm gonna. I figured why not share this stuff. I got back into the hobby, so I might as well start sharing what I've been opening. So um, yeah, look out for the next one. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Um, good luck. Um, um, happy hunting out there, ripping cards and looking for the for the cool inserts, because uh, you know you know what we love around here. The wild inserts. The wild, wild insert. The ripping and the tearing. The ripping and the tearing.